Hi, uh, welcome. And today we look at uh, Bliss GVS Pharma as a, a stock to hold uh, for multiple gains in the next few years. The reasons why we'll discuss further. Uh, so, what is uh, what does Bliss Pharma actually do? So, uh, Bliss Pharma actually uh, builds lots of uh, pharmaceuticals for uh, antifungal, antibacterial, antimalarial, antimicrobial. Uh, analgesic and several other ph uh, pharmaceutical drugs its main market is africa and about 85% uh, of its revenues come from outside of uh, india from uh, export markets it it is one of the largest manufacturers and sellers of uh, antimalarial drugs in uh, the sub saharan region and also has a strong uh, uh, position in the market in uh, antifungal dermatology and pain management medicines in uh, mostly all of the African markets. Uh, Bliss Pharma also operates in about 64 uh, countries, uh, uh, mainly around Latin America and Africa. It's also one of the biggest uh, uh, manufacturers of, of suppositories and pessaries, uh, where it takes up contract manufacturing for leading market players like Sanofi, Sun Pharma, Alchem, Mankind. Uh, also, uh, mid cap. Pharma in terms of uh, uh, perks from the government in, as per the Pharma Vision 2020 for manufacturing uh, will get a lot of impetus to such companies. So that's one of the reasons it looks like a good bet to take. Uh, also, I think this uh, is a outlier from the other pharma companies is because it has a good presence in Africa. But I think uh, the next wave of uh, growth is in the African market where these already have a leadership position. Uh, but like any other pharma company, uh, I mean, uh, margins and competition is always there in the pharma uh, space. So what is uh, the game change of this company is it's uh, about five years ago, it set up this uh, Bliss TVS Healthcare Limited, which is a managed healthcare operations. Uh, currently, it has about 70 clinics in uh, Kenya itself and uh, caters around 80,000 patients, which is uh, a huge number a month. It uh, offers also customized packages for corporate clients and has about uh, 18 lakh members in its corporate healthcare business. Uh, and this is the main contribution to its growth in the last uh, two to three years where uh, they've set up these new centers and if they look to uh, adapt this model across uh, different countries in Africa, uh, this stock's uh, growth uh, from this healthcare managed uh, healthcare services business will uh, uh, bring uh, big returns. If you look at its uh, sales and uh, its profits, it's been uh, increasing uh, uh, year on year, uh, where the expenses has been uh, uh, great in the last few years because of uh, setting up of these uh, additional uh, healthcare uh, clinics that they have uh, they have set up in Kenya. But if you see the revenues also has increased because of the setting up of these clinics, and this has been a big uh, Three-fold uh, jump, or probably two, uh, two point five x jump that we'd see uh, when the report uh, results in March 2018. Also, the operating profit has a huge jump currently uh, because of these healthcare service business that is incorporated into its uh, revenues and profits. Um, altogether, it looks like a good buy now uh, since it's broken out from its like two-year trading range of between. Uh, 140 to 200 so it's broken out of that range and i think it'll going to train to the uh, new range from now uh, so it's a good buy to uh, uh, buy the stocks between uh, 180 to 220 and hold it for gains for about 200 uh, 250 280 and i think a long-term target of 400 in the next uh, two to three years uh, doesn't look far uh, thank you for listening to this presentation and uh, as I mentioned, this is just for educational purposes. I am not a CB registered analyst and please consult your advisor before investing. The money and risk, uh, both are yours. Thank you.